All right, crew, so we are back here in the garage working on the 55, guys. We're actually starting to work on the inside of the cab here. Um, I already got my seat set and everything, um, steering column, all that stuff, previous videos you guys saw that. So now here I am working with a 2005 Ford Fusion shifter and console, and we're going to go ahead and try to fabricate some stuff up to make it fit in the truck. Um, and I'm not really sure yet what I'm going to do with the front. I know I'm going to have to cap it off or whatever, but it's going to look really slick when we get through with it. So let's go ahead and take some measurements, guys, and let's get right into this video. Hey, um, welcome back here. So we'll go ahead and get into this video really quick, man. Um, and hey, for you guys that are new to the channel, you're watching Resto's Mars Garage with CJ. Um, and this is where we do it ourselves, and we have fun doing it, man. I haven't said that in a while. So anyway, guys, uh, we're working with this 2005 um, Ford Fusion shifter. Um, I got the, uh, like I had to actually buy a cable for it. It's a little long, so we're going to have to fabricate a little, little bit of stuff here. Um, so here we, I went on ahead and measured um, this here. This is like two inches from the um, bottom of the floor to this pad here it kind of sits at an angle um and i will probably well i will mount it down to the um I stood down to the board that i have on my floor um so the main thing what i'm trying to do now is making sure this thing fit properly um, i'm gonna have to I cut some brackets here to make this a little sturdier and i weld these brackets here something like that there and we'll go ahead and put them all the way around. So I'm going to go ahead and, and get these mounted. And I'll turn you guys back on once that's done.
right, so I got my bracket welded up that I made. Really sturdy, so I think it's gonna work out good. All right, let's go ahead and set it in the truck. All right, so we went on ahead and took it out of the cab. Everything fit really good. Um, I went on ahead and put two bolts here so I can tighten this up. And this uh, come up a little bit here. And so just to tighten up this, just like that there. I have my little um, LED lights here. And I also notched this out for my electric windows that I will be installing. Um, so now we're going to go ahead and put a little bit of body fill on here. To just make sure it's smooth. Um, because I did do a little hammer and dolly in just to try to get this around it because I don't have an English wheel or nothing So you can see it's kind of got a curvature on it. So we're we're gonna go ahead and tighten this up and um, I'm gonna go ahead and put some body filler on it and then we'll go ahead and prime it and then after that We'll just go ahead and paint it. All right, so it's been a few hours man. I went to work came back home Let this dry. It's been drying now for probably about four hours so I'm going to go ahead and sand this down and I'm going to go ahead and wet sand it as well and we're going to go ahead and try to put some color on it. Alright so here we go guys. We got all the parts cleaned up and this is going to be ready to paint. I actually took my cup holders apart. The little glass that's in there. We primed it. I wet sanded it off camera. Um, so I'm going to paint all the, the center part gray and then we're going to wrap the other the rest of the console um in blue so here we go guys and like i said um like i told you guys before i'm gonna try to keep these videos kind of short so this is going to be the end of this video of me taking it apart uh making my brackets and everything for the center console now we're going to go ahead and paint it and i'm probably going to paint it today but i'm gonna go ahead and end the video now um appreciate you guys watching um, hope you guys learned a lot about trying to build your own console. And you guys seen in my previous videos, I've actually built them from scratch, um, you know, out of wood, all the way to a complete dash. Um, I've done it like three times. So look, go back and look at my other videos. See, I did this is going to be a little different. I'm actually already using a console, but I'm just making it fit my needs, you, you know, basically. And you guys can do the same thing. So hey, like I tell everybody, guys, if you got a good cigar, a fast car, truck. Smoke them if you got them, baby. CJ is out, and catch me, guys, on the next video. Peace.